you don't know who I am, but I have a checkbook and I'm going to create a foundation and you and I are going to start our way in finding the cure. My mom is a very determined woman. When your child's life is on the line, you're not afraid to make decisions. And I think that is only best represented by, you know, this whole foundation, how it started. I remember coming back from a trip and Allie just was complaining of an eyeball headache. It got to the point where I couldn't see with my left eye like five feet in front of me. The doctor who had diagnosed the optic neuritis said, okay, well, you could have four more years with her or she could be blind, paralyzed. Instead of just the shoe dropping, it seemed like all the shoes had dropped for me at once. I'd been very successful as a businesswoman, creating 13 infomercials and over 600 beauty products, but I was going to turn the page and I wanted to put together the Guthy Jackson Charitable Foundation. The Guthy Jackson Charitable Foundation is a very interesting model because they bring scientists together and they, they make them accountable for, for actually developing a program in the direction of, of a, a very specific disease. I made it very clear that funding was only going to happen in this area and in this regard as long as there was this collaboration. You have a whole group that never spoke before that are now I think excited about coming together and working together. And you get a, an explosion, if you like, of, of capacity, of innovation. We don't know where that cure is going to come from. We don't know where the pieces and how the pieces are all going to fall into place. And I love that Serum is really looking at, okay, this is our mission. This is what we want to do. And that are talking to even people like myself that are looking at what I'm doing to be able to do the best at what they do and make sure that the science really gets done. Some of the, the funding models um, are not particularly effective because they give small amounts of money so that the scientists can actually move in a small step in the direction that they need to go as part of their objective but they have to complete those studies and they have to reapply for funding. We, we believe that we, we should give the, the resources to go the distance. So in the past, we were sometimes delayed by lack of funding. With CIRM, we now know exactly what our task is. We know what our team is. We know what our, our objectives are. And one of the nice things about the CIRM funding is it really supports people working together. So rather than competing with the lab next door, we've developed methods to collaborate with those labs. And we hope to do in four years what it's taken us 20 years to do. And, and hopefully we'll do it cheaper than it's taken us over the 20 years. We, we share a very similar goal in that I write a check, I give it to great researchers and scientists, and it's important that it's not about just writing that check, but holding people accountable and helping facilitate that process. It's hard, I'm a mom, but I know that I just have to do the best that I can do every day to try to find the answer.